Welcome back everybody. Today is going to be slightly different. I'm just going to do a small tutorial on how to fix uh, like, well not a fix but obviously when you do gaming on Arc Windows 10 has slightly different code it does compared to Steam and because that some bits of code don't work without one factor. First of all just for no one, no one knows go to PC look at this users and clicking yourself Obviously, and then the rest is all hidden from here, so first of all, so obviously the users here, then just copy it like that. I'll leave a copy of it in the description. Well, you can just do it like that. And once you get here, you see all these ones we're going to be changing modifying the game one called game open a notepad what you do a notepad not wordpad wordpad might mess it up notepad is essentially the most basic thing out there wordpad might add things in which will make it unreadable possibly so see you have something that looks like this change things in the settings you might see them here got a stat modifiers that all here Things like that. Starters. Let's say you have big code like this. This is to change the craft recipe of the stone hatchet to utilize 10 stim berries. Also, I've got stim berries here. 10 of them. And flint with two flint. Makes first sense, doesn't it? So we'll see if I was put in here, go and save. Just like that. And I could close this, just saved. Saved it. But yeah. It'll be a idea. Good idea to close it. You don't want to change anything when the game's running, you're wanting the issues. Or the game might reset it. I think. So. It's night time. Okay, we're back. Now it's day excuse me. Now it's daytime and um not being attacked. If I was to go in my toy and look at the class must be it's stone hand shit. Obviously it's gonna be one flint and batch with steel. But obviously it means it didn't work. We'll see. It means something's wrong. But on Steam that would have worked. For example. So if we go back to the game with notepad, go down here and look at this. First of all, let's make a space. And if I go to my just little folder, I've got a small copy. I copy this in. If you look at the top, you'll see this is different. So Steam, I forget exactly, obviously I don't have Steam, but I know Steam does have this in the end of that one. So obviously the code works differently between Windows 10 and Steam. And this causes it not to work. So if I was go now go and save. Leave that. And then go back to Arc. I was now to go look. Go on, must be. It's two flint and ten stim berries. Also, when you get a pickaxe, I actually get flint though. <coughs> so, <laughs> I think they're going to have to work a bit to get stim berries. Also, there's probably a lot more better things you can probably do in this. Size, you can change stack sizes with it. I think the reason why I found it out in the first place, I did a lot of research. Now, if I got two flint, I can do this. I was going to say, I don't have a dusted base, do I? There we go. Long enough. We're going to make, I'll see. Let's check. I've only got two wood, two stone. I think that's not enough to make stone hatchet. And I've still got the same amount of all these authors. Voila. Done. I'm alive, sir. 
Sorry, just been just checked and something. Um, my life still. Anyway, what I left off, I uh, guess I'll show you. I guess I'll show them off my server code. And probably put it back in, so, <laughs> before I forget. Let's see, you look at this. That looks like a lot. When you come down here, though, this is where you see a big difference. Let's see, I've got a stack limit override somewhere. I think as in the... Oh, remembering. That's game you sends. Let's see, I've got... These are for like the single stack items, set for the meat and hide. That's before I'm testing, obviously at time, when I was testing. I did not know about this. Obviously I got some of the nuisances removed. Those are the worst ones, in honest, and I won't be deprived if I put below on this list as well. It depends when I get to the caves. <laughs> if I start getting really annoyed, they might get kicked out. <laughs> well actually, when it comes to caves, I could try to remove them without moving the actual dino creature because there's they're dim ones if I would go. I know for snow cave I'm vicious. Something like snow pervias or something in the cold. And then obviously I got two dinos. I did have a third. The third one was meant to be a dean just uh it didn't work. It just spawned raptors instead. Which was originally gonna be on Herbal Island because so cliffs are there, sort of around the back. Around the front. That and it's a place that I probably ain't used much, so you know. And then I was, did have coal. I don't know if I still got it. I think I might still. I think I was testing with the Raptor. Yeah, this bit code here. There's still, I don't know if it's working or not, but it's essentially meant to add a fertilizer to him. Just say, oh, so you have your level one and. You don't have the temperatures white, right, it will instantly die. I think. So you have to make sure you have plenty of cooling for it. But it's just maybe a way to add the non story art characters. Characters? Yeah, that's great still, I guess. Essentially, it's just a way to add them in, I think. Because we're doing a full story one for one few. So it'd be nice to still have a bit of fun. And fight. Fun, I think. If them. Uh, ice Bible, I'll probably add to scorch it up. Doesn't make sense, but it's got the Wyvern nest, so I don't have to mess around with it too much. Hopefully, yeah. it depends. It's a different nest. I don't really, I'm very sure they share the same nest type. The just though, had different nest, so. Actually, that's something I should probably miss test. Miss bust. <laughs> Can I use the other nest? <laughs> that would be interesting, though. Oh, so you got that. Then I've got a very big rewrite of all the supply crates. <laughs> so it includes the cave ones as well for the island. These all essentially exclude exclude the building items and anything that you got really commonly, like a stone pick. <laughs> for the way the pace I want the server to be, which is fast space, obviously, I would like to get through all the way to extinction. That is where we're stopping. Mostly, you want, not everyone knows the story, so try to show them the story. We also wanted to see what Genesis 2 looks like. Though, I guess. If, and if it would be worth it. Until then. Yeah, that's up to distinction. Yeah. If anyone wants this, uh, the supply drop code, I guess I could try to see if I can upload it. Don't know where to exactly. Maybe Narc forms or something like that. But yeah, if you put a couple comments and it gets liked or something a few times, and yeah, I'll probably will upload it. But yeah, other than that, that's mostly what my code does. <laughs> oh yeah, and I have this small bit at the bottom. Just to make it so it's easier. To, so you have a lot of uh, babies, like things that you bring your like army up, type of thing. Or just have generally a lot of dinos in your base. <laughs> It'll get hard to feed them. So I've got that down and got the wild dino food chain up. So you tame things faster. Again, fast base. It's the goal of the server. So that's why there's higher stack sizes, higher weight. 
all that. So yeah, I guess I should probably insert this. Um, oh, I forget. Obviously, the size is <laughs> hundred eight compared to roughly six. I think it is by default. Based on destination. Boom. Okay, that's ready for the next place. Have a. Until then, see ya. Goodbye.